Hi people of YouTube, this is my very first video so be gentle. I'm just going to give you a quick tour of my games room in my house. So obviously sign on the door, games room, do not enter, Madam Cave only. So there's my cat. So as we walk in, shut the door. Obviously picture of Rick and Morty, obviously, Rick and Morty fans. Uh, my partner is in the middle of drawing. I just about to see it on there. It's a drawing of Beerus, the destroyer. So she's drawing that and then she's going to paint it all. It's a full left down on the wall. Obviously, you've got to, got to have a guitar. Standard. Uh, homemade Disney years for my partner when we went to Florida. See, I'm big into touring car racing, so that's all stuff like that. Obviously, got pop figures, Thanos, Baymax, Shinron, Boomark, Barog, some Hot Wheels cars. I've got some more, but they're not on display. And um, pop figure, sort of a big pop figure display. He's asked my cat to go in there and hide, so yeah. Uh, I got the Star Wars X Wing on the wall. With a couple of raisin hats, so uh, Star Wars heads. Uh, some Disney Infinity characters. Quite a few there, my partners, to be honest, for the Xbox 360. That's my other cat. Obviously, more Star Wars heads. Uh, Disney Infinity Limited Edition dolls, these are also my partners. So. Uh, pan back around. More stuff then, obviously. Star Wars Helmet, Thor, the Mighty Thor. Uh, piece of the Nürburgring. Ring, well, piece of the Nürburgring, Ring, but we bought it anyway. Zero. Um, down here then, this is actually a skateboard which my partner painted as Pickle Rick. I had that for Christmas one year, I was very happy. Pop that back for a second. Obviously you've got our Stormtroopers, Vader, BB-8, some lightsabers. These are from Disneyland Paris, I believe. And that is a build a light build your lightsaber. This one. I can't find the button. Yeah, we get with you. Just some more. Yes. Uh Buzz Lightyear. A backpack which was meant to be used in Florida this year before the lockdown happened. We are in South Wales. Uh, picture I found in a car boot sale or yard sale for Americans. Me and my partner. More of their dolls there. Just quite to collect these. This is her sort of bookcase display. Some more Alice Wonderland stuff for it. Let's mention. Oh, another cool thing I meant to show is this is me as for Cheetah of Dragon Ball Z, which my partner drew on an iPad. And it was very cool. Uh, her Instagram page is Shauna Illustrations, so go over there if you want anything like this. She does pets, uh, drawings like this, anything you want really illustrated, uh, she can do. Let me just turn it down a minute. I'm gonna come back in a second because he's crying. Come on then, come on. Yes. Okay. So also here we also have obviously Star Wars films. That's a a must have in my house. Obviously Chewie's custom Disney years. They're not for sale. We have to get them made by somebody. I can't remember the girl's name now, but she's on Instagram. Um, this is my Dragon Ball Z section. So you've got some Broly films. Uh, Resurrection F, Battle of the Gods. 
a few of the old DVDs, well, all but new, if you get what I'm saying. Uh, Margin Boo, Sal, uh, Trunks, uh, Super Saiyan God, Super Saiyan Goku. Also, big fans of NCIS and Criminal Minds, so just some more, more DVDs there. Then onto my old school games consoles now. So I have my Nintendo Wii, uh, PSP, PS1, uh, Nintendo DS, a couple of games there. Uh, obviously, the N64, how late that was. Star Wars Shadow of Empire, uh, Double Seven, which is the best game ever. Um, Mega Drive or Master System for others, but it's sort of the classic one. So it's the Mega Drive flashback, still good, still reminds me of my childhood, which is awesome. Um, then we have the Atari. Two six hundred, which I've never managed to get working, but it's nice to say I have it. <coughs> uh, Nintendo GameCube. Let's see, Uka Uka. What's not his name? GameCube, with, I believe. Super Smash Bros. Melee inside. Uh, PlayStation Three. PS Two. N64, which is my favourite console of all times. Uh, these are my, this is my game storage area. I'm not going to get it. I got too many games in there to get out, to be honest. So, just pop them back in there. And this is also my Predator Bust. He is solid concrete, so he's going down the stairs if any burglars break in. Say hello. Yeah, uh -huh. that's Raphael. And that's Leo. Leonardo and Raphael after the Ninja Turtles, obviously. Um, then a cool thing I can install, well, I'd say install that I've put in here, I think is really cool, is coming here at night. I've got. Some colour changing LED strips above the telly, so I think change colour for one day, one year. This one's just a plain white one. That one colour changes. Uh, I have this one above the door also. Let me just quickly plug that one in. So I just thought that was a nice touch. So yeah, this is my games room. I say my games, it's my and my partner's games, but it's mostly mine, so obviously you have a Star Wars picture on the wall, sofa bed, just in case I ever need to stay in there and do not like that, on oh, Call of Duty or old school Halo 3. So yeah, that's the games room, that's the view out the window. Quite a nice view, actually. It's raining at the moment. So yeah, that's a quick tour, well, I say quick. That's a quick tour around the games room. So, I shall end the video here now. Uh, that's great.